Okay, so I've got a bowl. I'm going to chuck in my flowers. Okay. Now, depending on what kind of yeast you use, you could, at this point, put your dried yeast in there. If you use dried yeast, I'm just putting my salt in. Now, I've started my yeast off in here, 250 mils of warm water, a tablespoon of honey, and I've put that uh, packet of dried yeast in there just to get it going a bit. So I'm just going to mix uh, the two flours and my salt together. And then we'll just make a standard dough like we said. Okay, now, um, like I said, the Vikings did make sort of like flatbreads that they'd cook on sort of like a, a skillet type thing. Um, or they did bake loaves, uh, usually probably in a sort of a pit in the ground where they would put in their fire. Okay, right, so just make a little bit of a well in there. And now I'm just going to add in all that liquid, 250 mils of water, remember, tablespoon of honey, and the packet of yeast. Now, there is actually examples of loaves that they've dug up, but often, of course, like anything for that time, they would use waste pits to um, determine the kind of foods they ate. So, the Vikings were farmers, but the trouble was, Scandinavia, when winter came, um, you know, nothing would grow, so on. So, they would obviously do their harvests and then um, pickle stuff and preserve stuff and that's what they would survive on. Right, I'm just going to get this mixed into almost like a dough and then we'll start kneading. <laughs> 